The mother of a 12 year old boy accused of starting his own house on fire is now speaking out, telling Q2 tonight that she believes her son needs help. But she also doesn't believe he's capable of doing what he's accused of. This fire happened back on the 18th of September at a home on Yellowstone Avenue. Six occupants were inside the home at the time. A nine year old boy was flown to Utah for treatment of injuries suffered in that fire. Lisa Pulaski says she's the mother of the two young boys. The injured nine year old, she says, is back home now. The 12 year old boy who police say started the fire remains in juvenile detention. Pulaski does not have custody of the children and tells us they live with their father in the home where the fire was set. She describes the 12 year old as sensitive and believes that he needs therapy now to cope with this family disaster. He barely swore. I mean, he did get in fights in school, but it was always he was getting picked on bullied. He's um, very sensitive. He cries a lot. <laughs> um, he does have a temper. I'm not going to lie about that. That boy does. Um, he he kind of gets that for me. Uh, he hasn't learned how to not react when he gets upset. A 12 year old boy is still in custody of youth services where he's been since this fire. Q2 did reach out today to the Yellowstone County prosecutor who is handling this case, but as yet we have not heard back.